It's 102.7 KISS FM. Nelly Furtado just said, don't you have babies? And I thought, well, that's a strange question to ask me out of the gate. <laughs> Ryan has babies. babies, from what I hear. <laughs> that's a strange question to ask. Your babies are babies, cool. right? You like my babies. My babies are babies. No, my baby is a dog. I'm rescuing a dog. And, well, I've been working oh, on this for a really? few years. Oh, yeah. rescue dogs. They're yeah. so lovable, aren't well, Do you have a dog? No, but I have a sister with a rescue dog and a friend with a rescue dog, and they're both so charming. I'm thinking lab. Huh? I'm thinking a lab. Oh, you're thinking about this. Well, you haven't done it. I've okay. decided to do it. The problem is, I want to bring the dog to work every morning and have the dog sit during the show. Okay, part of the show. Part of the show. That's possible. Well, I think I I'll was... be better with the dog in the room. <laughs> you know what? I, I will. You might be. I was just on a show. It's funny you mentioned in Amsterdam last week. Sure. And I kid you not that you you come out. It's like you know the David Letterman of Holland sort of thing. Right. You come you come out with the dog, his dog on a leash. And you're That's like, part of the act. That's part you, of the, the show. The guests come out oh. with the dog. the dog. And this dog, of course, goes running as if on cue, the other direction, <laughs> oh, and comes around to the couch where the host is sitting. So I, I say you do it. Go dog. I hear that Amsterdam <laughs> is fun. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I don't know. They're, they're telling me that the uh, the building has rules, but we'll have to sort. Ellen okay. can help me with that. Yeah, I'm going to help you. So speaking of babies, though, I do remember when you were sitting in one of these studios with me and you were pregnant however many years ago, maybe two years uh, maybe, ago. Or maybe I just had the baby and I still look pregnant. <laughs> no, no, but I, well, maybe I, but I remember when you maybe. were pregnant. That no, time. it's true. My second album came out about two months there after Nevis was born. Yeah, and that was how many she's years six ago? years old now. Can you believe it? I know. Oh gosh. Kind of wild. You Just don't feel like George, she's seven. Yeah, seven, he's seven, seven right? So but you don't feel great. Okay. You probably don't feel like you're growing up, even though you are. Um, you probably don't feel like you are. No, not really. I mean, it's fun. The business is getting more fun. The more time I stick around in it, you know. Wow, and your Just... global business is huge. Nelly Furtado, by the way, <laughs> co-host and premiering. Uh, the MTV Latin American Awards 2009. Yeah, yeah. Tomorrow. Yeah, that's on tomorrow night. Check it out. It's on MTV Tres at 9 o'clock, I think. And it's all uh, over. Yeah, um, depending on Co hosting the show. I'm opening the show. My album. Um, hate to brag, but it's been number one for four weeks on I the Latin know, charts. It's called Mi Plan. It's all in Spanish. And Manos al new, aire. My was, new love affair. I was talking about that earlier with Roger, who was out there waiting with your picture in the courtyard. Um, but <laughs> oh, four, so cute. Four weeks yeah. at number one is fantastic. <laughs> you know. I mean, I was looking at all the countries, by the way, where it's been number one as well. It's not just, it's all over the place. Yeah, it's not just Spanish-speaking yeah. countries. So it's people Germany. Are, I guess well. it's good timing, you know, just for like people are more open minded about music. I mean, again, 10 years ago when my first album came out, it was like, whoa, whoa, what are these influences? Brazil, India. It was a little odd. But now with, you know, iTunes, Internet, people are more sophisticated. People are ready for anything. So I'm going to come back and talk about it in just a second. 826 on KISS. Nelly Furtado's album's been number one for four weeks, and we are talking major global success. And this is an entirely Spanish album. Sí, mi amor, todo en español. Did, did you, I'm going to ask you, <laughs> I, you know what, just to be fair to the audience, I'll ask in English, and okay. then you can answer in todo Spanish bien. if you like. Okay. I, I, if we do it all in Dale. Spanish, <laughs> some people will be left out. Did you, did you attempt to go English? Mm, yeah, por you un did. poquito, pero me bit. faltaba palabras en inglés. Right, I kind beautiful of, eyes. I ran out of, oh, yes, and you do and too. You look very <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I kind of ran out of words in English. It was the craziest thing. I got off the road after Loose, my third album, and it was a long tour. Got back, and it was like, tried to get in the studio, and, I, and it wasn't really happening in English. I just, I couldn't really think of anything new to write. So I just started writing in Spanish, and it was like, wow, exciting again. You know, I've, I've since, you know, written. Right. In English, so I guess it cured my writer's block. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, no, it's just a natural thing. I've been recording in Spanish for about seven or eight years. Um, singing in Portuguese also, another Latin language, uh -huh. way before English as a child. So it's all very comfortable. So you had the writer's block. Yeah. was overcome by writing. <laughs> That's interesting. Mm -hmm. was, it yeah, the same, was it the same type of material that you were trying no, to do in English? No, more or love, different? love, lots of love songs. So but not were, ballads. Wait, like so it's a rhythmic were, album, but it's... Darker and angrier in English? And then I, I don't know. And I, I don't Spanish? know. No, Spanish is just, you know, everyone knows. It's, it's kind of like, it is kind of, well, one of languages of love. I guess some yeah. people say French is, but it's, you can be a bit more passionate. You know, you know, girls, you know, when we sing and we're so angry in English, we're just the angry singer. <laughs> 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 Come on, tell me you don't know that. But in Spanish, you can be as, as loca as you want to. I there like Loka. <laughs> <laughs> well, what what about what about for English fans? Is is there my a, English a time fans, where you can overcome the English writer's well, block? Some of them are listening to this stuff and kind of going, "Wow, you know, don't tell me what the song's about because <laughs> I just I really like the mood it puts me in." <laughs> and then you tell them what it really means, and they're like, "Oh, uh, I thought it meant something different." <laughs> so so they're liking this chair's not my friend oh, no. today. <laughs> um, so the, no, I've been writing in English. Yeah, actually, I have a new a Tiesto track coming out. With Tiesto, um, 
It's called Who Wants to Be Alone. It's like uh, for his record, Kaleidoscope. Um, I don't know if you know. He was a dance act. You uh, know Tiesto. Uh-huh. Um, sort of the same band. Well, Dave Getz. Is this all part different. of your label? Um, no, my label, my album's out on my label, uh-huh. Nellstar Records, and um, yeah. And then I've been. I don't know. I, I got together with Tim, and last spring we did some tracks. It was fun. I don't know. Where Soon are those though, tracks? sometime in 2010. The tracks? The Timberland tracks. Tom Tim's about. hiding them. He, well, he's going to be here Friday. <laughs> Let's search his pockets on Friday. He's coming in. He's holding yeah, on to yeah. them? No, I don't know. No, it, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep recording. Probably in 2010, I'll put it something in English for sure. So Nelly Furtado, there's no the worries, backstory. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't stress. <laughs> you can see her on the uh, Latin American Movie Awards. It's not the movie. It's yeah. The, it's and check out my MTV. music videos. They're like telenovelas. Is it movie like or is it music operas. awards that you're doing on th- MTV Tres? Uh, MTV, it's the MTV Latin America it's the, Awards. It's the music yeah. awards. Yeah, what, music, what you music, open music. With? How are you I'm, open I'm, the show? I'm opening the show with Mano Salaire, my my single, Mano Salaire, which means hands in the air, which is a love song about surrendering to love, and it's the one that's been number one for a while, and it's um, it's kind of like a pop rock type of tune, but it's 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 aggressive and fun. It's and good. then and then you have to so you're performing and you have to host it. I'm hosting too, yeah, with actually this amazing character, um, Rene from. Residente from Calle 13, a reggaeton yes. group from Puerto Rico. Um, very funny guy. Do you shtick when you come out? Oh, for sure. There'll yeah. be some jokes. There'll be fun <laughs> stuff. There'll be some, there'll be some, tra- some surprises. All right, it's 8.37. We'll come back with Nelly. Kiss. It's 102.7. Kiss FM, 8.41 in the morning. So here's the deal. Nelly Furtado is here, and we have got tickets right now. Ooh. VIP tickets to Los... You say it with me. Los premios. 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 Los, Los premios. premios Latino America. That's right. I'm from Atlanta. Give si. me, come on, give me a little credit. You're from Atlanta? Yeah, can you tell by my accent? I don't know. Los <laughs> Premios, MTV 2009, Gibson Amphitheater. Tickets still available, <laughs> Ticketmaster.com, but we got some VIP tickets for you. It's going to be fun. Call her 102-800-520-1027. All right, so thank you so much for getting up this morning. In oh, my your God, new thank moon you. Look. You're thank in your you new moon look this me. morning. I know, I'm wearing my new moon-inspired all black <laughs> boots. It's just like, aw. And good luck tomorrow <laughs> with the show on MTV. Oh, MTV thank 3. you. MTV Tres, check it out. Check it out. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>